Hello kids, it's Danielle here for the second part of your Lent little study for you guys. And this week is about passionate worship. Being excited, be worshiping God. So I want to start with a story today. It says, here are the children's shouts. As I read the story, to start out, I want us to wave our hands like palm branches. Wave your hands, wave your hands. And every time I say Hosanna, I want you to raise your hands. Hosanna, Hosanna, ho, oh, hello, I'm sorry, I didn't see you there, I guess I wasn't watching where I was going, I was just so excited, I just saw Jesus, he came into town riding on a donkey, did you see him, well, I sure did, I stood on the side of the road, waving my palm bench and shouting, Hosanna, then I followed Jesus into the city, he went to the temple, so many people came to the temple to see him, some of the people who could not see him, and guess what? He touched them and made them see because they couldn't see. Some of the people came could not walk, but Jesus healed them and started leaping and dancing around. Dance around the room, everybody, dance around the room. And then the children came into the temple. The children were so much fun to watch. They waved their palm branches and shouted, Hosanna, Hosanna. <clears throat> but the temple leaders did not like what the children were doing. Do you hear what the children are saying? They asked Jesus angrily. Jesus nodded. Yes, I hear them, he said. Remember, God wants even babies and infants to praise. Then Jesus left the temple, but I can still hear the children shouting, Hosanna, Hosanna! Let the children in the temple. Let's shout like the children in the temple. Let's all shout, Hosanna together, Hosanna, Hosanna. So, worship means to really love God, to show God that you love him just how, because how much he loves you. So this week, what I want you to do is I want you to find stuff around your house and make musical instruments out of them. Spoons, uh, pots, anything you can think of, and make a little band with your family. And play a musical instrument. Play a little song together. It doesn't have to sound amazing. This is about worship. Just like these kids in the story. They saw Jesus coming and they had to shout, Hosanna! Hosanna in the highest! So I want you to do it. Also, when you pray to God during your snack time or when you eat, I want you to consider that worship. When you're kind to your friends, when you clean up your house and your room, when you go to school, that's all worship. Worship doesn't just happen when we go to church on Sunday mornings. Worship is all the time. It's everything that we do. So this week, I want you to make some musical instruments and worship at home. And remember that every single thing that you do is worship. The last thing I want you to do as a family is I want you to do a parade at home. Get whatever you can. Get your musical instruments, get some streamers, get some pieces of paper and wave them around and just have a parade around your home and have fun with it. We are celebrating God. He loves you so, so, so much. I'm going to put this in down in the bottom for your parents, but I want you guys to read Matthew 21, 12 through 16 together. I'm also going to give you a little handout to look at. So that you guys can do some games and do some fun things together. But one of these is um, a picture of some churches. And I want you to draw in the picture of what you do for church. What is your what, do you, what happens at church? How do you worship God? Maybe you can draw you and your family in there. So there's three things I want you to do. Number one, I want you to make some musical instruments at home and celebrate and worship God. Because he loves you so much. And when we worship him, we show him how much we love him. The second thing I want you to do is with your musical instruments or pieces of paper or whatever you can find at home, have a parade in your home with your family. Parade around your house shouting, Hosanna, Hosanna. And third, you'll have a little handout that you can draw you and your family going to church together and you can color it together. I hope you have a wonderful week. I hope that everything's going great and remember that everything you do is worship.